Rob. I'm making my response video to the randomizer rocket how to and I'm gonna let you know how it worked when I tried to build this thing. You can see I didn't do the stand exactly right. I didn't put the stickers on. But the stand, I didn't think I needed that whole contraption with the moving the rocket around, so I opted not to uh put that on. I just got some half inch PVC parts I fit together, didn't glue them, and a pizza pan and a bolt. Drill the hole for the rod. This is all found at uh, Home Depot. The pizza pan was 88 cents at Walmart. Uh, this thing you got to play around with to get it to stay, but I think it'll make a fine stand, and I'll just go with it like this. No paint, no movable thing. I could not find a three-quarter inch riser because those are for sprinkler systems and it's snowing out in Home Depot, Lowe's. I couldn't find a riser. I did try these other rockets where you attach a stick to. Um, these did not work. I used the kitty lighter, as Saki said, and pounded it down. I used the uh, powdered sugar with the stuff grinder mix, the white mix, and put that. I drilled it out. Just like he said, it did burn. It made a lot of smoke. However, it didn't have any thrust. It just fell over. Boom. I'll post that video on here also. So, I think I'm going to end up buying the real rocket engines until I figure out how to do this. Or somebody uh, responds to me and helps me with making the engines. wasn't something I could do. The rocket itself went pretty well, actually. I think it's going to make a good rocket. Uh, we got the golf tube. You got these uh, corrugated plastic signboard with the uh, three-quarter inch PVC coupler I cut in half. Hot glued it. Just this quick paint job piece of tape around here for the bottom. I put some tape on here. I didn't do the, si the stickers. I don't think I need the stickers. That's the piece of pen with the signboard glued on there with the hot glue. Uh, now, the, definitely the most, the hardest part about this one was driving to all these stupid stores trying to find the right parts. Going to the dollar store, the Giant Eagle, uh, the sporting goods store. It was a lot of running around. But I did find the uh, plastic uh, champagne glass. This one had kind of a funky design, which I just left on there. Uh, but it would not fit properly the pill bottle. I tried some different pill bottles, and this has to be the right fit because it's going to have to pop off. It's going to have to stay on there good, but pop off. So what I did was I wrapped some bubble bubble wrapper with some tape on the pill bottle, which is the only way it made this thing fit. And that, I think it's going to fit tight enough to fly and then pop off. I don't know if, it, if you have any luck with the brake pill bottles and this. I would have had to take this to Walmart and try every pill bottle at Walmart. But then the most pill bottles wouldn't fit in here, so this, this whole thing is a... Uh, I don't know what you got to do for that, but... I would try some foam rubber wrapped around here or something. This is the hardest part. The rest of it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, I think it'll fly good. And I'll post that video when I get the uh, rocket engines. Thank you very much. Bye.